Well, the search is on for whoever shot and killed someone at a shopping center in Northwest Charlotte. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight at 11. I'm John Carter in for Molly Grantham. Charlotte Mecklenburg police say there were multiple witnesses to the shooting this afternoon on Mount Holly Huntersville Road near the intersection of Rosles Ferry Road. Now we first brought you this as breaking news on air at four o'clock. Our Nikki Hauser was the first reporter on the scene and she has been talking to police and bystanders tonight. She is live outside CMPD headquarters. Uh, Nikki, what's the latest on this? Right, well, John, we still don't yet know the name or the age of that person who died today, only that he was young. Police describe him as a young man, and we are still waiting to learn who the shooter was or any other information about that person. But people in this community say they want that person to be found, held responsible, and they also want this violence to end. Among the busy hubbub of this shopping center along Mount Holly Huntersville Road. A lot of gunshots. Someone pulls a gun, people run away, and Charlotte Mecklenburg police say a young person is now dead. A young man today that is no longer with us because we weren't able to take the road that allowed us to overcome our differences and now we have a family and a community that is is dealing with another loss. That's Major Ryan Butler with CMPD. He tells me the shooting happened in this parking area of a shopping center just after 2 p.m. after some sort of dispute. Violence got to stop. Don Watkins says he saw the argument while inside of his car just feet away from the gunshots. Anybody could have got hurt. I was in the parking lot when they got the shooting, you know, so I had to drive wildly getting out of here. I could have hit somebody. Anything could have happened, you know. This impacts all of us. Major Butler says everybody. his team is working to get answers. This is a very active investigation, gathering evidence from these businesses and their surveillance videos and from several witnesses like Don. Just hate to see something like that happening. What's this, a, a Wednesday? <laughs> so. 2 o'clock, almost 2, 2.30 on the Wednesday, so this is what you get. Shoppers and police alike pleading for the community to curb the violence and be better for one another. And I know we as a community all want better. We have to do better. We are capable of better. Um, we all have differences. We all have disputes. But we cannot continue to turn to violence. Police are working to identify who did this. And John, I was there. There were plenty of people around a very busy day in that shopping center. So if you saw anything, if you know anyone who was there, please ask you to step up and come forward with that information. Live in Charlotte tonight, I'm Nikki Hauser, WBTV on your side. All right, Nikki, let's hope someone steps forward and gives police really good information.